It hunts invisibly from above. Flourishing in remote forests, as well as nearby plantations. And too often, it comes in contact with us. When surprised, it often chooses fight over flight. The white-lipped green pit viper. It's found throughout Southeast Asia. But across the islands of Indonesia, this one small snake causes up to 50% of all venomous bites. Human fatalities are rare, but birds, small frogs, and rodents may not be so lucky. Once hidden, the green pit uses a combination of tools to hunt. First, the snake uses its tongue like a nose to track its prey, sticking it into the air to pick up scent molecules. Its two forked tips deposit the molecules into the Jacobson's organ, located on the roof of its mouth. This organ tells the brain if these scents are from a potential meal. Once locked onto a scent, the ambush hunter settles into place and waits. Hanging motionless, coiled in a characteristic S-shape, ready to pounce. As prey approaches, the pit viper employs its most remarkable trait, its pits. These pit-shaped organs contain membranes that sense the heat given off by warm-blooded prey. The snake processes the information with the same part of its brain as it uses for vision, resulting in a thermal image superimposed onto the visual one. This enables the pit viper to hone in on its target with pinpoint accuracy. Hinged fangs rest against the roof of the mouth, ready to pop open like a switchblade for the strike. They pierce deep into the mouse, delivering a hemotoxin that begins working immediately. Breaking down and destroying blood vessels and causing massive internal bleeding. Once the toxin takes effect, the green pit uses its fangs to walk the prey into its mouth. Head first and whole.